jump up. Yes, she's sick. She might not live as long, but didn't change her mind. Good girl, you can dance. <laughs> Bailey came to us as this typical, happy, young, bouncing around puppy. <laughs> We decided, with that loud of a murmur, to get a specialist in. Those smaller blood vessels allowed pressure in the heart to get too high, not enough blood would flow out of the heart, and while this was a very happy, healthy-looking puppy, uh, that's actually a ticking time bomb. She met the cardiology staff, she had an echocardiogram, and then they were able to tell us what was going on with Bailey. One of the problems, if you fix one of the problems, it could make the other problem worse. So she was a little complicated, but um, we have a very experienced cardiology staff, and they were just fascinated by her condition, and they really were all looking forward to working with her. I was given the instructions to not fall in love with any dogs because we were not taking a dog home. And so we went in and I'm playing with all the puppies and then all of a sudden I turn around and my husband's sitting on the floor in front of her kennel, just. <laughs> we asked some questions. We just, we, the more questions we asked, I think we just kind of, we found that the answers didn't matter. Don't you, Bob? Know your limitations and just trust your instincts and, you know, when you know, you know. Did you do a good job showing them how pretty you are? <laughs>